Hello and welcome back to my City Skylines Let's Play series. We're picking up from where we left off in the last episode. Uh, what is going on over here? I don't know. But anyways, welcome back. In this episode, we're going to be doing some more expansion because I have some ideas and stuff I want to do. And the first thing is that I want to move this water public station because as you can see, it is right... If I just click away here... Um, and click here and click here. You can see it is just getting to the pollution level. We don't want that. We want to move this over. I'm gonna move it over here. Way over here where the water is coming from the river. And I'm gonna pause the game actually so these people are not starting to complain about leakage of water. And then we will have to put down some water pipes and then connect it like so. We don't need this anymore, nor do we need this right here. There we go. Alright, if we take a look at the water, sewage treatment is starting to get a little bit low, so I do believe we will probably need another sewage uh, handler, extractor thing, whatever you want to call it. Connected, there we go. Uh, how's the power looking? Power's looking pretty good so far. These two are producing pretty good amount of power. I love it. But anyways, today we will be expanding quite a bit. As you can see down here, we have a high demand for industry and offices, which means we probably want to expand the industry a tiny, tiny bit. Not too much, but uh, a little bit. And in fact, I can already see how we can do so. If I just expand it, uh, let's actually take it this way, go down here, and then go over across like this, and then we delete this bit here. To make it look nice and then we add this bit and then yeah let's let's go through why not and then we can add a tiny tiny bit of industry uh i don't want to add too much also before they actually start populating the industry area we need to add some policies of course uh we don't need we don't need this over here actually um only the big line over there don't need this, don't need that. That was for our old industry area over here. Um, don't know why these guys are complaining about water. That is because I forgot to <laughs> add some power to these guys. So let us uh, just do that real quick. Whoopsie, my bad. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's, that's why people are starting to complain about water. Actually, not the people, only the industry area. That's interesting. Anyways, that is done. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I already see the mistake. Zoning, zoning, otherwise pollution factories are gonna come and we don't want that, so no good, no thanks, goodbye. Yep, all right. Good, yep, that's right. I know you just started building your buildings, but sorry, get out of here. We don't want pollution at our city. Uh, I say that, but we will be able to fix this eventually. Now, in the last episode, we did unlock the hospital, the police station, and the uh, fire station. But to be honest, I don't really think we are we need that much. We have um, fire stations around. We got it, I think we got it pretty much covered. We are in a little bit of a danger over here, though. So maybe I will put down one over here. Just a small one, a normal one. That's gonna benefit all of them. Hopefully that will make things better. It is trees and stuff over here. So, um, yeah, if things go bad, they really are gonna go bad. Uh, do, 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 do. Also, I do see that it might be a benefit to put that road there. Um, and this is gonna annoy me. Put that there and also put that there. Okay. Good, 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 good. Uh, yes. That's wonderful. It's not so nice we have that right there. But, um, actually, we could put two. Uh, if we take a look at our garbage disposal. Uh, garbage... Well, you see, there is this one thing we got. Which is this. Nope, not the oil power plant. <laughs> uh, where is it? Hydro power plant? No? Solar power plant? Where is it? When, when are we getting that? Hold on. Um... There we go, incinerator plant. Okay, so once we reach Big Town, we will get a lot of stuff like high density residential area and high density commercial zone and office zone, which I am so super excited about. And metros, that is another thing. I wanted to do some bus lines that have this episode as well. I can't even speak, I'm so excited, yay! Okay, so 
Before we continue into the video any further, it has already been 5 minutes, I just want to say a huge thank you to the people supporting me on Patreon. It's greatly appreciated. If you're interested in supporting what I do, be sure to head over there. Link down below in the description. I will try and shout out people that are on my Patreon on every video. Um, if not directly by putting the names up, at least giving them a shout out. I don't know if future me will add the names on the screen, but we will see. Anyways, if we go into here, as you can see, we can, uh, we can expand our city area, our city border right now. I'm going to buy this one, but let me know, because there is one thing that I'm not sure about. As you can see, this is farmland over here, and also this is forest. Should we have industry stuff over on the other side of the main highway here? Over here? Should we do that? Or should we keep our little square here? Because if we don't have this thing, it'll be a lot easier for the highway to just go straight through and then for the city to ex expand over in this area. Let me know what you think. Leave a comment down below. Um, but yeah, let us take this. It is only 2,900. It got some cool stuff. And I'm gonna purchase that. We can actually already get another one, so we could actually get this, but let me know what you think, because if we're not getting this, if we're not doing that, then I could expand up here. So yeah, let me know what you think. But anyways, our city border has now expanded. Ooh, that is so cool. Um, yeah, that is actually pretty sweet, which means we can now expand this. So if I just take this, on a 180 degree and just blast it through the countryside right here something like that boom pause the game because uh yeah otherwise not good stuff is gonna happen because of the power line that was just cut not caught cut cut as in scissors scissor cutting i don't know i don't know what i'm saying here uh stuff i'm sure you can guess it uh, let's do that, and then we just gotta connect this up somehow, and I do believe we could do something like this. Just raise it up a bit, and it should be connected to the system. We also gotta collect it, collect it, no connect it there, and we can also, in fact, get rid of this, because our park is now in the power zone, so that is good. We just need it over there, nice, that is good. This is connected to it as well. This is connected. Okay. We are doing good. We are doing good. Uh, they are completely. They want some more commercial areas. I uh, guess we shall give them that. There's this area in here that has not yet been claimed by anything. I do suppose we could add that as a thing. Also, maybe some over here since it's right there. And you know what? How is the power looking? No, just there. Uh, a bit annoying it has to be right here, but you know what, it's fine. I'm just going to put some residential right there. And we could add some more here, but I, I'd rather wait with that to be completely honest with you. Uh, we want this to go up, but I have some plans here. I want to take this road, because now soon we will be getting... Um, in Big Town, we will get that this episode, I promise. Um... We will get high density residential zone and high density commercial zone. I want to put that kind of over here. Maybe make a little separate section for it over here. But first, before we do do that, I want to just make a couple of homes ready here for when we actually do. Uh, let me just lower that. There we go. For when we actually do reach um, a pretty good high demand for residential. So let me just see here. If we go down here and let it connect there, maybe. And the power line got cut again. Oh dear. Sorry guys, but we are reconstructing. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. So now we can put some stuff in here, residential and commercial and all that stuff. How is that polluting? How much is that polluting? Not too much. I think we're good. Um, yes, things are going up. Things are going up. Uh, what is going down though is our money, but that's fine. Let us actually add some bus uh, routes in here. So let us add some buses. By the way, if you are enjoying the video, be sure to leave a like and also subscribe if you haven't yet. It helps the channel grow. 
And yeah, the support is greatly appreciated. So, here we have a bus depot, but we also have a biofuel bus depot. The biofuel bus depot works just like a regular dust depot, except that it sends out biofuel buses instead of regular ones. The biofuel buses are much more quiet than regular buses, but carry just as many people. Place the depot before the crazy lights. Let us do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it right there. Boom. Right there. Now we can play stops. And I need to remember how to do this. I think I'm gonna make a line, create a new line right outside the bus depot. Then I will make a stop right here. So all you gotta do is place the bus depot before you can choose the stop. Then the bus line stop will come. Then you just click on that and then you just do this and you can see the dot that is where it will add a stop. I'm going to add a stop right there. People will become happy. And you do have to be careful not to place it here because then it will do all sorts of weird stuff which we don't want it to do. So just keep doing this and then I do 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 that would be nice if it was connected. Uh, can we do that real quick actually just the just uh, just put the line there and uh, that's gonna <laughs> that's gonna make people upset. There we go. Okay. And back to this. Alright, so then we go over here. So just make it into a loop here, that's what I'm gonna do, make it into a loop. I'm not gonna go all in through all of these. Maybe we could do that eventually if we wanted to. But I just wanna do a, a quick loop here. There we go. We should also earn some money from this, so that is always nice. And then finish the loot up there. That is that line completed. The bus will then uh, soon. It should send out buses. So bus in use, it sends out the bus. And that should hopefully uh, start doing its work here. To be honest, it would probably have been better having the bus depot over here. So, you know what? I might actually move it right there. Because otherwise it's going to do that. Yes. So, we're going to move that. And I do want another loop as well, which is going to be over here. Oh, dear. People are complaining about power. What are you talking about? Le Whoa. Okay. Um, that's not good. But we have money, and we're going to put down another wind, wind turbine. Boom, there we go. That should add more power to the grid. Hopefully. Start. Please. There we go. Noise. Um, do, 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 do. I do want another bus line going around here. I do believe we should be able to do it right here. So let's see. And then we can add a stop here. And then I'll add a stop here. And then we can add another stop here. And then uh, stop here. And then complete the line. That should hopefully uh, get sent some buses to it. Hopefully. Yep, bus in use. Beautiful. Then those will get sent forth to that specific spot. I don't know how much money we'll be, ma be making from this, but we'll, right now we're. Actually, this is expenses. <laughs> Let me see. Um, we're earning. Uh, no, wait, that's the budget. Uh, huh? Oh, that's how much we're earning. Not too much right now, but it, it, everything is a little bit, right? And it will keep the people happy. And I do believe we will earn a lot more um, going forward. So, let us get started on this bit right here. I know it is dark. It is annoying, actually. Let me just wait till it gets daytime, let the city run for a bit, and we'll get right back to it. Stay tuned. Stay tight. Stay tuned. Uh, yeah, but whichever, whichever you want to do. Be right back. All right, it is now daytime. We can now see what we are doing. I did actually look at the traffic, and we might in the next episode have to see if we can possible possibly in any way improve our traffic because I don't think our roads is that great so we might have to upgrade some roads put some bigger roads like down here make this into one big road going all the way up here for example um, this doesn't seem too busy but like this intersection here here this roundabout and up here just because it's great doesn't mean it is a bottleneck but up here it does seem a little bit tough so we might have to put a roundabout here as well we'll see about it we'll see about it um, we should be good for now, though. We should be good for now. Just because it really doesn't mean that it... What's it called? What what word am I looking for? Busy. There we go. Finally. Yeesh. Okay. Okay, so right there. 
pause the game because we don't want people to get angry. Uh, there. And then just go down. And there we go. Now we made a bridge. Yay, hey. It's gonna look a little bit strange, but we'll have to fix that in the future. Alright, so over here I want the high residential area to kind of start, I guess. I like the idea of houses. I don't know how we will continue, but I guess this is how we will start it. So, yeah, I don't know if it's a good idea. Of course, leave suggestions and stuff down below. Always appreciated. Love those comments. Give them. Give, give, give them. Give them up. Okay, I'm going to delete those because we will be making a quick roundabout. There we go. Yes. And that is all one way. That is beautiful. Now we will connect this up like so. And this up like so. And I do think we will be making kind of a... a um, kind of a square, if you will. I don't know why that changed. Can I change the road type? I don't know. That, wait, that's three lane, that's two lane, what? Oh! Ha ha ha! Whoops! Yeah, we don't need that. We don't need that. Let's, let's just get the grass one, I think. Even though this looks a lot nicer. Let me just, um, upgrade these back. There we go. That's fixed. Now it looks better. Um, hmm. You know what? Let me put some roads off camera on, actually, because, uh... Then I'll spare you to having to look at this. Okay, this is my result. I don't know how well it looks, to be completely honest with you. To be honest, it, eh, I don't like it too much. But um, it will have to do. Looks like we need some more industry to get going, so let us add that. I will, of course, expand the zone here while I still remember to do so. Like that. And I will even across, extend it across the bridge here. Highly needed. I do believe you could get high residential zone um, uh, buildings, like the these self-sustaining buildings. I think you could actually get that as well. I think that is pretty cool. Right now, we just need people to be to be completely honest with you. We need some more people in here. You know what? Let us add. Uh, first of all, how about we add that there? Then we add this here. Because people want that. And... We could add some more low density residential. But I do think we might want to add some more business stuff. Um, we could add more here. But I feel like that would be too close also to the park. I'm not sure. Eh, let's just add it. Why not? Add it we might as well. Yeah. I think that'll be fine. That'll be fine. And looks like people want more industry as well. So that is just expanding uh, this right here. And then just fill in some industry right there. Oh, of course, water, 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 water. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm just going to let this game go a little bit. And until we reach Big Town. And then I think in the next episode, we will be taking a look at some of that stuff. So be right back with you. And we reached Big Town! Okay, I'm gonna take a look at that in a second, because I was just in the middle of actually adding in a public library, because it seemed like people actually wanted that. I'm just trying to figure out where is the best spot to put it without ruining too much stuff. 
But if we do see here, we now have the office zone, we have the high density commercial zone, and we have the high density residential zone. Pretty sweet, but I was looking at the elementary school, we needed some more, so I plopped one down here, and high school, we, added, we needed another one, so I plopped down a Institute of Creative Arts, an alternative to high school, and I like that idea way better, so that's what I'm rolling with. Um, I also went with the community school, and Modern Technology Institute, alternative to the university, I like that a lot better, so we will be using that in the next episode. But let me see here, what's this? Uh, university, we don't want to use that. What is this? 90,000? Hey, yay, we do have t We don't have money for that, but whoosh. Um, I want the best place to put this. That would probably be here. Public library. Sorry guys, I know you just moved in, but goodbye. Public library, um, that's gonna be pretty centered. So maybe if we add another one in over here. Oh, here we go. That's doable. How about here? Oh, that's even more doable. Yay! Do it! There we go. Sorry, but people want libraries. I don't know if they really do want libraries, but they will get them. But anyways, let's take a look at what we got in Big Town. We got a new area, so we can do that. Taxation policies. Uh, I don't know what that is. Taxation. Uh, tax rates for low density residential. Tax rates for high density. Blah, 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 blah. That's pretty cool. Don't know if we'll even use those. Level 5 unique buildings. Metro. We can set up some metro if we want. IT cluster. New policies. Education boost. You can read all those. I'm not going to read those out. New zones, of course. And new buildings. We got some toll booths. University incineration plant. Metro station. Solar updrift power. The warmth generated by sunlight is what powers this power plant. That's cool. Modern Technology Institute and Fishing Island, which I do believe is like 40,000 or something. If we go all the way over here. Yep. Nope. 9,000. Could we fit that? Yeah, we could. Okay. I don't know. Maybe that could actually fit well down here. Maybe if we could add, if we could add that to something, if we have some city shore thing here, that I think that would be pretty cool. Um, we also have Metro now. I don't know if we'll use that. Probably not. Um, we'll also need, of course, police over here. Yeah. We might expand in this area as well and continue this down here. And then I do think... Oh, let me just bring up something <laughs> so we can see. I do think I want this area to be pretty special. To be like a beach-type area, a waterfront area, a sight to be seen. Maybe raise the taxes there, because taxes there, that's going to be a pretty expensive place to to live at right outside to the ocean maybe I will have to probably do some off-camera not work but practice at building roads and designing and such but um yeah I think that's gonna be pretty cool again let me know down in the comments if we leave the industry here or should we move the industry out of this area and all the way over here where we could also have some farmland and grow some beans but yeah that's gonna uh, be it for this episode leave your thoughts down below and leave a like for the video if you enjoyed it and smash that like button yeah, I already said that. Smash that subscribe button if you think you're doing it and didn't, haven't already done so. I think I need to quit. Enable those notifications. Be sure to check out my Discord server, Twitter, Twitch, Patreon page. Everything is down in the description below. Hope you enjoyed and hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.